It's a great day for hockey cards, and today I'm excited because I went to my local Target and I bought out the entire store of this product. That's right, 1920 SP Retail. And uh, before you get too excited about me buying out the whole store, this was it. <laughs> this was all they had. This one beat up, damaged box that uh, hopefully we uh, we don't have damaged cards inside this box. But we're gonna get five cards per pack, eight packs per box. There's the odds. Uh, people generally like this product mostly because there is a chance that you can get autos and memorabilia in here uh, and a half decent chance. So you'll get an auto or memorabilia about every other box with these. Uh, if you don't get that, you'll get a numbered card. Those are very good odds for upper deck retail. They don't really have a lot of retail products where it's easy to pull um, autographs. So we're gonna bust into this and see what we can pull. I hope to eventually be able to secure, you know, maybe a couple more boxes of this so I, we can at least get all the top rookies and stuff. But for now, we've got just this one box. The entire stock they had at my local Target. All right, so here's our packs. And our damage cards would be on the top. So let's leave those packs on top. We'll see if the damage to the box actually indicates damaged product that we will be receiving there we go let's do the packs on top and let's get right into this so first thing we'll notice with the base cards oh pulled connor mcdavid right off the bat that's nice um same as sp authentic except it just doesn't say authentic on the sp the base cards are exactly the same that's exactly what they did last year as well with this. And of course it reads SP hockey down here. So we got Connor McDavid instead of the red parallels, you get blues in SP, which I actually like the way the blues look better anyway. So we've got an SP rookie authentic of Emil Bemstrom. The back of those look like really, really deep blue on that. We've got Blake Wheeler and Elias Pettersson. Pack number two. Hopefully we'll pull a jersey or an auto out of here. That makes, always makes the break a little bit more exciting. We've got Claude Giroux. We've got a blue of Brady Kachuk. And we've got a rookie authentic of Noah Dobson. Once again, love that, love that shade of blue. Jeff Skinner and Jumbo Joe Thornton. Next pack. Taylor Hall, interesting, still in his uh, Devils uniform, much like his SP card. You would have thought they would have had a chance to change that into a Coyotes, but no. Jonathan Marsh's show. And we've got an authentic profiles of Brock Besser. I don't know if this is a blue parallel of it or they all look blue. As usual, I, I don't normally watch breaks of a product before I have a chance to open it just so I can kind of find it out for myself. Artemi Panarin and Miko Rantanen. Oh, this pack's gonna fight us. So we've got John Klingberg blue off the top and I noticed we didn't get a blue last one unless the uh, authentic profile count is a blue. Oh, and we got a jersey. We've got a Carson Kuhlman SP Rookie Authentics jersey. There we go. So we won't be getting an autograph, probably. We've got a Rookie Authentics of Barrett Hayton. And the last card in that pack is going to be a Victor Arvidsson. Mikhail Granlund, we've got a Nico Heischer blue. We've got an authentic profiles, a numbered card of uh, Artemi Panarin. What we got there, that is. Print it right on the other foil. 334 of 649. I 
kind of printed it right on those foil stripes. Makes it tough to read. And we've got a rookie authentics of Quinn Hughes. So there we go, one of the big rookies out of this year's class. Joe Pavelski. These packs are... It's a really satisfying open with these packs. They're just the right amount of resistance, if you know what I'm talking about, when trying to rip them open. Ricard Raquel. We've got a Jonathan Quick Blue. And we've got an Ilya Mikheyev. Ricky Authentics. Four the Leafs, Roman Yossi, and Braden Shen. I think we can beat the odds and maybe pull a second jersey or an auto as well. We did get a numbered card too, which I wasn't expecting. I figured you would get either a numbered card, an auto, or a jersey. So we probably beat the odds there. Andre Vasilevsky, got Jack Eichel, and our Blues, Drew Doughty. And a rookie authentics of Rasmus Sandin. We just recently pulled his young guns in the last video. And a Natty Mac. Last pack. Forgot to mention too earlier on, this costs 25 US. So normally an upper deck blaster is brand new at most of the stores down here is $20. This is $25. Ben Bishop, Jacob Truba, and authentic profiles of Cam Atkinson. Thought I noticed a mistake on there. Did not. Yes, Barry Kutkinyemi and Jacob Slavin. So there you have it. That is our damage box of 1920 SP Retail Hockey. Uh, what do you think of this product? Overall, I don't I don't think it's bad. 25 bucks if you if you pull a jersey or a, or an auto it's half decent um, of course to ensure you're going to get one since I believe the odds on those are 1 in 12 and you only get 8 packs per box so about every other one of these you're going to pull an auto or jersey at that point you're talking 50 US if you're buying at least 2 I don't know there's there's I would probably go for an older box of cards uh something from a few years ago that would guarantee an auto, but I don't think these are bad. If I see some more, I'll pick them up. Uh, I like the design of SP this year, and I like the design of the Rookie Authentics uh, and the Authentic Profiles in, in this set here. But uh, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like the channel, please hit that subscribe button. We're slowly closing in on 6,000 subs, so that is pretty awesome. But thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.